Hi ladies, I'm here to help you winterize your skin. So this is something we should always do and we get a little bit behind in this, but it really makes a difference to help those fine lines that crop up and are there in the spring when we don't want them. So we're gonna weatherproof your face and here's just some ideas how this can really help. So when it's cold outside, it dries our skin out terribly. And right now it is bitter cold. And so going out to even shovel or walking anywhere, you can tell how dry it gets. And I know that we cover our body with clothing, keep it protected in our hands. We wear gloves where I try to, because when I don't, I get sloppy. I end up with eczema and my hands look wrecked. But we can never cover our faces, right? So hydration is the key. So dehydrated skin equals fine lines. So remember that. So chap skin can do a lot of damage and it can really make your skin show all the lines and the uneven skin tone and everything that we don't want. So here's just a couple of ideas. You can try using our new hydrating sheet mask that come eight in a package. Just a couple of times a week will make a big difference when you have time. The other product that's fabulous for this is our moisture renewing gel mask. This is a product that you can use as a mask, put it thick, leave it and take it off, or you can see how it is, it's kind of clear, but it only goes on nice and smooth, it's light enough. You can wear this all day if you wanted, or you can just wear it at night to bed, perfect product, that's moisture renewing gel mask. One of my favorite products though, is our hydrators that we've had for years actually. Now there's the oil-free hydrator. This is more for normal skin. Maybe you've got a little bit more oil. It's a light feeling. And then we have our intense and moisturizing cream for dry, dry skin. Both fabulous. Now these are like giving your skin a drink of water. So literally, you put them over your moisturizer to get that extra hydration. So I'll just show you this one, which I put on this morning. I'm happy I did because it makes such a difference. You don't need a whole lot. This one's thick because it's for dry skin. So this one, of course, when you're dry, you want that to go on. Love it, love it. And it has a bit of a sparkle so that when you do put your foundation on, you can just tell it has a really nice finish. Both are excellent. Love both of those hydrators. Then don't forget your lips. We forget about them sometimes and they become a mess. So satin lips will really protect you. One has the sugar scrub, which we know will help take off the dead dry skin. And then the balm, of course, which we know what to do with that. And make sure even if you go out for a walk or to shovel that you wear a balm to protect your lips. Okay, so we did that. But here's something you probably didn't think about is that maybe you should update or take a look at your foundation. And we do and should wear foundation in the winter because it protects us again. It's another layer of hydration. And so if you're using a mat, probably in the winter you should switch to a luminous type because the mat will actually enhance the fine lines and it's maybe just not quite right. So our CC cream is one of the foundations that's perfect for hydration because it can hydrate for 10 hours. So that's popular and very good. And then of course you have our other liquid foundations, but try to stick to luminous and check your color. Um, you can set your makeup if you want to, just to keep everything in place. And you know what, we have a setting powder. We also have the famous translucent powder. The white color is perfect for everyone because it suits every skin tone. And here's the deal. People get worried about powders settling in fine lines but this won't because you're hydrating to begin with and then you're just using this light, light translucent powder and you won't have that problem. Excellent product, love it. And it, it uh, you know, remembering that hydration is the key there. So then you should add a pop of color just so you don't look all faded out. And we do have our liquid eyeshadows that are fun and easy to use. And we now have light beam back in stock again. And so literally just a little bit of this on the lid and you'll look good for the day. And then don't forget, we have our lips, which you should show a pop of color. And we have a Supreme Hydrating Lipstick that's new, gorgeous, gorgeous. Comes in many nice colors, and we need the color in the winter. So this one, we do have a nude, of course, and there's a plum and quite a few other choices. And this one's called Poetic Pink. This is the one I like to use. Gives me a little bit of color, and the hydration of it is amazing. I'll even use it during the day at home. And then of course, maybe a just a swipe or two of a good cheek color. I like this one just a little bit, just to give your cheeks a bit of a highlight and a 
a bit of color so you're looking healthy. And then that's all you need to do to winterize your skin. And you know what? Here's to a fine line free season, ladies. So hope you enjoy. And uh, that's all I have for you. But winterize your face. Thank you.